more than 150,000 people have died. And our economy is in shambles because of a virus. Just imagine if we had a national strategy. Six months after it began, the nation is still unprepared. If you want a president who defines the job of spending hours a day watching TV and zapping people on social media, he's your man. Donald Trump is the wrong president for our country. Donald Trump inherited a growing economy and a more peaceful world. And like everything else he inherited, he bankrupted it. For close to four years now, he has shown no interest in putting in the work. No interest in treating the presidency as anything but one more reality show that he can use to get the attention he craves. I'm sure there are Republicans and independents who couldn't imagine crossing over to support a Democrat. Joe Biden will be a president we will all be proud to salute. At its most basic, this election is about preserving our democracy. Joe and Kamala can win by three million votes and still lose. Take it from me. They know they can't win you over with their policies. So they're hoping to make it as hard as possible for you to vote. So this is the team to pull our nation back from the brink. Joe's plan to build back better includes making the wealthy pay their fair share. I accept your nomination for Vice President of the United States of America. So it's a great honor and humility. I accept this nomination for President of the United States of America.